The countdown to the school year has begun and pretty soon we're going to be filling up those lunch boxes. It's not easy switching meals up, trying to get a healthy breakfast on the table in the morning, making them fast, keeping them healthy. So to learn how we can ease up the process, we are joined this morning by Chef Andrea Renee with SheCookedIt.com. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, I mean, Yum. this breakfast looks like a weekend breakfast because it looks amazing. I know. <laughs> yeah, it involves know. pots and <laughs> so quick to make. Tools. But maybe for the first day of school you want it to be special yeah you want to get make sure the kids have a healthy breakfast especially the first week of school getting back into the routine sleeping and uh -huh. getting breakfast for their brains to function properly mm -hmm. so you want to do a quick healthy breakfast for back to school so th th this is quick how would you do it this is very quick so, so you, you just add a little bit of butter uh -huh. and then you want to add there's some onion sauteing here and then you want to saute in some garlic and she then, has like as you're cooking that this is yeah, the this finished is what product it's gonna, here so this is an egg scramble marsala Yummy. So then you have a few eggs in here. Uh huh. And then you want to have cheese added into that as well. The cheese makes everything better. Okay. And so once you add that in, we're going to throw in some cherry tomatoes. Uh huh. A little bit of green onion. And then for the seasonings to make this a marsala, we're going to do the ginger. Uh -huh. Ooh, that sounds good. Oh, that yeah. does sound Cumin. good. I was wondering what you meant by marsala. So, Andrea, yeah. my kids go. will eat the scrambled eggs. This is kind of cool because it's like all the ingredients of maybe an omelet, but right. scrambled eggs. Definitely. So maybe they'd go so, for that texture. Right, and the, the cumin and the ginger just gives it a different flavor. Yeah. And so once you add in a little bit of green onion. Uh-huh. And the tomato, and it's, it's ready. So in two or three minutes, this is... This Fantastic. is what you get. Yeah, so, so while you're stirring that, because we don't want that to, to burn, uh, let's talk about lunches a little bit. Because yeah. I, I, I mentioned, I think I've had the same four lunches on rotation for like the last three years. I think I years. ate the same one lunch my whole right. Oh, well, see, then my kids are lucky. I mean, we need easy, go I need to add in two or three things, Andrea, is what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, so for that <laughs> this year, I'm, I'm speaking about the Rayburn's Philly Cheese Steaks. Okay. These are ready made. You can put them in your kids' lunch. You can cut them in half. And once lunchtime comes, they're already thawed out and they're fully cooked. Oh, The bread is amazing. super soft. So yeah. those are a really good deal. Oh, I see. So you're saying that it doesn't require it doesn't putting require it in the microwave really and things anything. like that? It's yeah. really cooked. You just need to thaw it out. You take and it you out of the freezer. When I ever you are home, when kids are coming home for after school snack, they can uh -huh. have these also and they can warm them up. But uh -huh. these are great for a school lunch. Okay. that yeah. That is great. Um, and then Talk about just sort of other things, keeping it healthy. I mean, our go-to, I think everybody's go-to, right, is PB&J. PB&J is good, but there's so many other things that have proteins like eggs. Uh -huh. Having eggs weekly is so good for like the brain function, oh. heart health, nutrients, minerals. Protein is getting its heyday right now. Yes. Yeah. And then we have these also, these Southern Recipe Small Batch Pork Rinds. Oh. They have so much protein in those. Yeah. And protein is essential, especially for, for kids in school with their brain health. You're right, eight grams yeah. of protein. That's so really good this for a snack scramble? like that. Yeah. Right, you can just throw some of those ground up Oh, like a little top. top. Yeah. And it's perfect. Well, it gives it a good crispy, crunch. Crispy, but yeah. protein, protein, good for you. Protein, protein yeah. Healthy. Okay. That's okay. great. Tell us about your website. So can we find some of these recipes on there? Or? Yeah, so you can find this web recipe on my website. It's www.shecookedit.com. Uh -huh. And I'm also on Instagram and Facebook. But you can also get these two items at any Kroger, Walmart, HEB, and online. I love that you brought in things I can buy at a normal grocery store. I know. Thank <laughs> you. Store. <laughs> Don't have to go to a specialty <laughs> store. Um, and then on your website, do you also have this? Uh, you know you have this recipe, but do you also have other suggestions? Yes, there is a block full of free recipes. And I'm going to be doing this week, especially because HISD is coming up uh -huh. next week. I'm going to be do doing a full block on back to school lunches. Oh, very helpful. Yeah, I love that. Very helpful. I'll add that into the mix. Yeah. I mean, my four are pasta, like, so they're eating it cold with just like yeah. Parmesan cheese, <laughs> PB and J, uh, uh, yeah, and now that's I'm why I those. never would have thought to get something from right. the freezer aisle yeah. that yeah. I put into a put lunch into box. Into right. Lunch yeah. Okay. Andrea Renee, shecookedit.com. Thank you so much for coming on and talking with us this morning. Me, yeah, we'll make our mornings a lot easier.